Holy luggage invasion. Okay, you guys, so this week the hashtag Zane Deserves Privacy trended on Twitter after a couple of girls found, <clears throat> actually more like stole his travel bag and posted a video showing everything inside of it. I am sorry, okay? Even if you guys found the bag, that doesn't give you right to go through it. That, my friends, is called invasion of privacy and the only thing I can say is WTF. Warning, do not mess with directioners. I repeat, do not mess with directioners. All right, you guys, so let's take a couple steps back and talk about how this all went down. Now, according to the directioners in question, back in May, they went to the airport in Peru to see if the One Direction boys were gonna be there, which is where they ran into One D's hairdresser extraordinaire, Lou Teasdale, who apparently is the one who dropped the bag. Naturally, they quickly grabbed the bag before anyone noticed, and by the time they decided to give it back, apparently everyone was already gone. So they did the responsible thing and kept it. <laughs> Suddenly, Zane's infamous beep tweet makes a lot more sense now. Homeboy lost his luggage. So now, fast forward to this week, and the two girls decided they should totally do something with the bag. So they posted a video on the internet of them going through it and showing everything inside of it. Once again, you guys, WTF. Hey, you just made the biggest mistake of your life, baby. Now the video's been deleted, but the pics remain. And I know it's super hypocritical to show the pictures in this video while I'm talking about his privacy, so I have gone ahead and blurred them out, but I feel like I need to show them to prove a point. You guys, these things are really personal. Clothes, drawings, keepsakes from Peru, and underwear. Yes, you guys, undies. Okay, so we now know that Zane has his initials written on his Ralph Lauren's, and A, that's pretty adorable, but B, we so should know that. Hashtag, Zane deserves privacy. Okay, it bums me out that anyone would have their privacy exploited like this, but real talk, Zane is like the most private guy ever, you guys. If he posts a selfie on Instagram, it is a trending topic. That's how little it happens, which makes this whole situation worse. His private things are all over the internet. That's just crazy. And look, I understand that you want to be as close to your idol as you possibly can be, but at the end of the day, this is just kind of a bullying situation, and you know how the boys feel about bullies. Obviously, when it comes to bullying and stuff like that, it's quite an important issue that we wanted to obviously be involved with. You felt like when you was at school or whatever that you maybe should have done something about it then even and said something about it. It's quite, like, upsetting to see. No bueno. Anyway, I really hope Zane gets his bag back, but until then, let's go ahead and shimmy along to the WTF lesson of the day. So just because you're a fan doesn't give you the right to exploit your idol's privacy. You guys, just let them keep their underwear. Whew. Okay, you guys, let's talk this one out. So if you were one of these two girls and you found this bag, would you have given it back or would you have done the same thing? And also, do you think this is an invasion of privacy? Let's talk it out in the comment section below right now. And also, subscribe to Hollywire TV if you get a minute. That would be awesome. And thumbs up, like, and fave this video as well. For Hollywire.com, I'm Chelsea Briggs, and I'll see you guys later.